The biggest NBA stars attain a level of lasting global fame that makes them instantly recognizable. But only one NBA star became an international icon purely for the GIFs. Or the GIFs. I'm not sure how to pronounce that still. This is meme history. And today, we examine a player with two Mount Rushmore level memes to his name. Why you be the meme man? A player whose meme ability best even his NBA skills. Respectfully. Oh, Nick Young, of course. Swaggy P. Nick is a meme king. He had a hell of a career and maybe even better one in memes. Oh man, Nick Young. Nick Young is the walking meme himself. But don't feel too bad about laughing. Nick Young is in on the joke. People still come up to me every day and be like, ain't you that meme guy? Can you do the meme for me? I think it's all a part of just the, the swaggy people sign, I tell you too. Uh, and and it, it fits, it fits with who I am. So yes, we're laughing with Swaggy P, not at him. And sure, maybe there was some raw talent left unrealized on the court, but we can't help but love the guy. He's also like particularly lovable as a person. He was playing with everybody else, you know, doing what dolphins do, the ant ant and all that. It was my time to, <laughs> to ride the dolphin. For some reason, he took me all the way to the bottom, you know, so. Um, yeah, he's trying to uh, drown me. Nick Young is kind of like our funny friend. Like, and everyone knows who he is. Anyone else does this face, it doesn't quite land as well as Nick Young. You like Nick Young, but you know he's goofy and he's like childish and silly and carefree. This is an example of it, but we love it. And that's why it's so funny. Let's start with Confused Nick Young, an all-time classic that transcended the sports meme category. Some people just give great face. And maybe it said something about Nick Young that confused face is probably the ideal one that he offers. It became such shorthand for that emotion so quickly on the internet that it kind of never relinquished its hold on that particular reaction. This is one of the few, and I don't want to say early, but one of the most popular, dare I say, animated memes without words. Like it just has the question mark symbol and everybody kind of knows what that is. And the fr the timing of the meme, I don't mean to get all off on the artistic quality of these things, but this is the kind of person that I am. You invited me, so this is what you get. The quality of this meme on a Zoom level is actually pretty impressive because it uses the natural camera elements, overlays the question marks. Excellent work out of whoever created that. The mastermind behind the meme was Cassie Athena a photographer who was working on a YouTube series called Through the Lens in 2014 when she asked to document a day in the life of Nick Young. When I was watching the episode, I was like, where can I add like funny little expressions? And throughout that whole video, there's a bunch of them. But that one moment in particular, I just thought Nick's face looked so funny. And I said, I'm gonna pause the video and I'm gonna add question marks. And I don't know why I wanted to do that. And I was having a really hard time getting the timing just right, zooming in, everything. And so when I finally did it and uploaded it to YouTube, I don't think anybody really thought twice about it. It probably took like months and months later before somebody screenshotted it and it started to like really get traction. But at the time, I just, to me, I just thought it was funny and it was a cool moment, but I really never expected it to go viral. So what was confused Nick Young so confused by? The most relatable thing ever, his mom. Oh, what's the name? He's playing for the Lakers. Judge your box to volley him. They used to play at Robertson, and Nick would just come in like a little kid and take the ball from him and do some crazy act and leave. If that boy ever take it serious, he'd be great. But he was a clown then. <laughs> Mom started talking and cracking jokes on me and, you know, saying things I didn't think she was going to say. That witch caused me to look at her like, are you serious? Like, in front of the camera. That is hilarious because he's a clown currently in 2023. So why is he trying to act like he's not? There's no mystery in that. We all, we didn't know Nick as a child, but we all knew he was a clown. I mean, did she tell any lies? <laughs> She's not telling, like Nick, you know who you are. She wouldn't lie, she wouldn't lie. Well, I didn't think she would say that, you know, she supposed to build me up at that moment, you know? As a kid, she supposed to make me look good. So I wasn't expecting the clown part. The clown part kind of messed me up a little bit. <laughs> and of course the meme went absolutely bonkers viral. It was on everybody's timeline, in everybody's group chats, on t-shirts in China, in the middle of a Drake versus Meek Mill beef. Even people who didn't follow the NBA knew Nick Young's face 
because of the meme. Anytime I saw, you know, huge celebrities or people I was fans of using it, I was like, that's my work. Like I edited that in my house. Like that's so wild. <laughs> and as much as everyone could identify with the level of confusion on Swaggy's face, there was a specific subset of Twitter who celebrated finally having a visual representation for what is you talking about? The reason why it mattered so much in black Twitter is because this had this could have been any brother in America. This could have been any brother across the globe. But this is very clearly Nick Young. And I would also go so far as to say, this is very clearly like a black household. I'm not really sure where they are, but I look at that person's house and I think, oh, that, that's a black house. You know what I'm saying? And so like, whatever is happening in that room is within a relative level of space and safety so that when your mama calls you a clown, you could just gotta look at her and then look to the camera check. I mean, the camera awareness from Nick here is just stellar. I mean, I assume that everybody like culturally has a face like this, but I love this one because it's so specifically black. That face that we've all seen from our moms and we give to our friends when people are saying something that doesn't make any sense, like, what? <laughs> that feels like, like home to me. I love this meme, it's one of my favorites. As great as Confused Nick Young is, it wasn't even his only classic meme from the calendar year. Because at the end of the third quarter in a blowout win against the Knicks in March, we got the quintessential Nick Young experience. I was feeling myself, you know, I was feeling good. We was winning. That was my moment, that was my year, you know, that year, that was my team. I couldn't do no wrong, so, but I was about to do my little showboat, Swaggy P moment. And it turned into a Swaggy P moment, really, so. <laughs> You miss 100% of the shots you don't follow through on. Oh God, there was nothing more swaggy P. Now this one doesn't get used as much. Just the braggadoche, right? I love this moment so much because I thought it encapsulated Nick Young's personality. I just love the confidence here. You should be that confidence when you shoot a shot, but maybe you should look and see if it actually goes in. I had the Steph Curry confidence and then turned around. It was like, oh man, I missed it actually. Swaggy P defined his career and the fun he wants to have and the reality that sometimes that fun isn't always possible in one four second meme here that has been replayed millions upon millions of times. There's never been a better way to sum up Nick Young than that play. This became a cautionary tale. Celebrate too soon? you might find yourself on Shacked and a Fool. But the part that's lost to history in all this is that Nick Young was balling that night. He dropped 20 points off the bench, including going five for six from three point land. That's right. If you're not picking up what we're dropping, this was his only missed tray all night. Young, Hardaway defends, five to fire, three. He was on a heater, but this is what we remember. Like, I had no idea that he had scored 20 plus off the bench. I just remember this shot. One of his best nights ever, you know, it, like a lot of people will never know that, that the guy almost was perfect from three on this night. He should be confident in that moment. <laughs> He's been shooting the lights out. And that one just doesn't go down. And But again, with memes, it's rarely the truth that even matters. The context is like a salad at a buffet. It's there if you need it, but I'm gonna bypass that and just Visualize this gift in the context in which it's delivered online. Like you shoot and you shot and you missed. I don't care about what happened the previous couple of minutes because this is the lasting moment I'll take from it. But congratulations to Nick Young for, for unloading against the Knicks that particular night. The internet never loses. And in this case, the internet got a perfect symbol for when you think you got it, you probably don't. I see this one a lot when someone gets rejected on a date. I thought that this person I was shooting at was was on board and was feeling me. But then all of a sudden she hits me with the okie doke and boom, she's not really interested. Would you send that hey you up text? Three dots pop up and then there's no reply. <laughs> that, that's what it is. Oh, we good. I'm out. Psych. Oh man, this particularly resonates with me because I am uh, I played defensive back in the NFL and we are the most 
arrogant, cocky, celebratory bunch. And sometimes you gotta celebrate a little early and then things go wrong. That's great. Maybe like the Falcons in the Super Bowl against the Patriots, Tom Brady, up 28 to three. They probably celebrated a little bit too early. That's usually when people use this type of meme and it, uh, it always hits the spot. Nick Young scored over 8,000 points in an NBA career that spanned over a decade. But he's also behind two Hall of Fame level memes that we'll find funny forever. And fortunately for us, he finds them funny too. In 2017, actor Lamar Morris was sitting behind the Lakers bench when he decided to have a little fun. And he was calling Nick, Nick. And I turned around, he had the meme on his face. After that, every fan in every arena kept trying to do the same thing. <laughs> the lesson in all this? Maybe we should take ourselves a little less seriously, laugh a little bit more, even at ourselves. For better or worse, maybe we should be a little bit more like Swaggy P. There's going to be some memes that outlast the memories of some presidents. And this is one of those memes that 40 years from now could still be relevant if we're still using screens as computers and we're not all wearing VR headsets. I don't know, I think more people, when the world ends, are gonna remember this Nick Young meme than what like Franklin Pierce accomplished as the president of the United States. For a while too, I was known as, oh, this is Cassie, the girl that made the Nick Young meme. And to this day, if I meet somebody and they're like, well, you know, they might not be familiar with my work. If I say that first, they 100% know. So even if people might not realize that I shot it, the fact that it probably made them smile at one point, to me, that's, that's enough. I love that. I think I'm, I'm in the top five, for sure. Top three of me, you know, ever, you know. I think me and Jordan had a good run for a couple years. So yeah, you know, I'm a mean king, yeah. <laughs> Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.